Good evening my fellow role players. How are you doing in this fine night? We just got in Hermione's laboratory, a druid from the Skellig Islands. And uh, yeah. Let's do it. And there's no water. Tales about the wild hunt. I don't know what we are doing here, but oh yeah, the mask of Let's go try and find it. And is this the mask? Er A goat carved out of linden wood, signed to Uncle Ermion. Little Ciri's handiwork. Laboratory worthy of an imperial alchemist. A sword in a stone. Things begging me to pull it out. It's not in the stone, don't you see? It's held there by a vice. Finally, something happened. Looks like Ermion places something in the statue's hand. The skull. That's definitely the skull. How about a mug of mead? Statue or not, everybody needs a drink sometimes. Huh. Seems like it worked. Who would have thunk? Ermion enjoys jests achieved at the expense of others. I have a sneaking suspicion. I hear something. I freaking hear something. Something stomping. I guess Jennifer is not going to help us. And hello. What is that freaking green thing? That's a scaring thing. Not not the giant. It's that. Is that? Geralt, come here. I found the mask. Oh yeah, get it. Go get it. I'm going to stand here. Yeah, I guess I'm going to get it actually. This is it. Um, there's a giant right beside it. And I don't think it's safe. Yeah, just it. like that. We must return to the feast quickly before. Teleport! Use the teleport! What the freaking hell? hell? Teleport, dude! No, that. I said teleport. Yeah, I didn't know that. I didn't know that, Jennifer. I swear, you are just so stupid. Everyone knows that already. You're just going to let me hit you? That's it. Ouch. It doesn't really hurt us. It just... Run. I swear, our companions, whenever we have one, doesn't really do that much damage. Look at this. That his HP is not dropping at all. It's, it's just a flashy thing or a distraction. All the damage, all the damage are coming from us, not not him or her. What the freaking hell? What happened? Ouch. That hurt. Come on, Jennifer. I know you can do it. I've done all the freaking job. Fun. Look around for a way to escape from the top. Great stuff. Shit. Gotta think of something quick. Shit, freaking shit. Let's stand in the center. Let's light this stuff. Hopefully it will help us. Uh, Yennefer, instead of just standing there, help us. I'm sorry. The damn druid will poison us. This vapor's deadly. We've got but a few minutes. Teleport us out of here. Think of something. Quickly. First thing to come to your mind. Tris! No. Hold on tight. <laughs> I said no to you. If you didn't, if you didn't see, I, I just thought of trees. 
and uh, it appear uh, uh, the an option appear that I want to kiss Yennefer. Please, Chris, I want you. I thought of Chris. I didn't think of anyone else. I thought of Chris. Where is she? Oh, we're right. We're still on Skellig. In the keep. No, heed my words. There is no greater act of valor than to fight a beast cursed. I guess they are too drunk to notice that no greater day that than stuff that happened here. Serve the goddess. Words of uncommon beauty. We thank you. Where is Hermione in all of this? We've stolen his uh, mask. seen Bran off to the beyond and must now choose his successor. A king must be wise. A king must command respect. A king must have bollocks. We've no lack of men like that. Let those who feel worthy of the throne of Skellige step forth. I don't like this face, the face of this guy. I should also drop my sword here, my silver sword. Behold his axe! Behold his will! May the best man, a woman, win! What are we going to do? What about me? I want also to participate. I want to become a king. Yeah, I don't want really to become a king of these guys. What's got into her? She's your daughter, is she not? Now I know why she said she'll sail to speak her out. Ah, children! The older they grow, the more trouble they are. Come with me. All the more essential we talk now. These are uh, these guys, this populace here that I will be a king of are too rowdy to be. I don't, I don't like them. <laughs> a king that doesn't like his people, that's uh, will go, that will go well. I remember well her nan, her mother, what they were like. They say the apple doesn't fall far from the tree. Siri was impossible to control. No telling her what to do. Had to have things her own way almost always. Why do you ask? No specific reason. She and Ceres, they're of a similar age. But we'll speak of my children later. First, let's speak of yours. Yennefer claims Ceres in trouble. And you seek her. That's right. If you require aid, Gold, ships, anything. Merely say the word. I'll give you all I can. And I know the last lives. I'm sure of it. When the blood of Rhiannon's daughters is shed, the sea grows white with fury. I'd mark such a storm. Need your help, Hermione. We know where she might have been. Why do we help? We did help for Ermion. We need to Magic find Ciri. Magic anomaly on Ard Skellig somehow related to Ciri, or so Yennefer believes. It's my strong suspicion, but I can only know for certain by examining the site. I saw the twisted forms. Right on natural. The druids were barely able to contain it. Explain to me, Yennefer, how Ciri might have caused this great catastrophe. I'm intent on learning that very thing. Which I will do as soon as Ermion stops hindering my investigation. Don't concern yourself with him. Druids have little trust for mages. 
But Ermion's heart is in the right place. Am I right to assume he does not know you seek Ciri? It's of no concern to him. As I thought. At any rate, Art Skellig's my isle. You have my permission to investigate as you see fit. Wondering if I should talk to Ermion. Leave that to me. Go. Seek and find your Cyrilla. If any ill befell her here on Art Skellig on my watch, I'd never forgive myself. Thank you. No need. I swore an oath once. I aim to keep it. Anvil! Tell the druid I must speak to him. At the usual spot. I like I, I like this guy. Approach. My children. You remember Yalma? Well, he swore an oath to kill the giant of Unvik. Set off and has yet to return. But as Ceres announced, that she's to set off on an adventure of her own. Got it in her head that Udelric is not mad, but cursed. Giants. They've been extinct for ages. Anyone actually seen the one on Undvik? Aye. Dozens of refugees have. The giant drove everyone off the isle. I've welcomed what remains of Clan Tordalach here on Arskelig. I heard a rumor that an unnatural frost gripped Undvik before the giant appeared. It's true. At any rate, Yalmor decided to kill the giant and give the isle back to its people. A deed worthy of a king, he believes. My son gathered a hearty crew at the new port. They were to sail to Unvik, then travel on foot to Oska, the village. But that many lads should have killed the giant long ago. Thus, I thought to ask you. You should start at the new port. Ask around. Hjalmar might have told someone there his plans. Take it Ceres wants to lift the curse. There's no curse to speak of. Ceres has decided she must match Yalmar and sort out a deed worthy of a queen. Think she might need my help? You did plan to ask me for it. Why? The thing is, I don't trust Udalric further than I can spit. Ceres won't listen to me, or her brother. Yet confronted by a professional who will explain why she's mistaken, she just might come to her senses. So, yes, I ask that you explain things to her and bring her back. Why do I need to solve this guy's problem with this child's? Yeah, no, wondering. Got no plans to vie for the crown yourself? Think a good number of the Jarls would support you. You're too old. A good number? Those opposed would be fierce, rabid. Madman Lugas would sooner see an elf guardian on the throne. Besides, a man should know when to step aside. Hand the tiller to the youth among us. Uh, I hope Skellig doesn't Either fall just because the, he doesn't have a king worthy of respect. I like Skellig. I didn't even visit. No, I'm just you. always just going to. I'm we just. Determine if Siri is still on Art Skellig. I'll change into travel attire and find you. Head south. The anomaly we should investigate destroyed a stretch of forest along the shore of the bay. A successful feast on all counts, Krak. I will see you later. I always judge something or someone from the appearance. Almost all, most of the time I get disappointed, but I'm level three, yay! Don't die on me, old man. Uh, I guess he's uh, still drunk. Oh, come on. So here we are on our destination for the main you quest. You two clear on the other side of the island. Good. May all Skellige know, Jennifer of Vankerberg is a common thief. Control yourself, Druid. I haven't stolen anything. I 
merely borrowed something and fully intend to return it. Ha! A generosity. Just one small problem. Once used, the mask is rendered completely worthless. Not to mention the risk you'll bury us alive and all the Isles with us. What are you talking about? Barry, what are you talking about? She's not told you? Might have expected as much. The myth is that Urborus created the mask when the envious seas swallowed his beloved. Unable to bear the prospect that he would never again see his betrothed, Urborus made the mask which would allow him to peer into the past. He knew, however, that he could only use it once. So he waited. Waited until his longing grew so strong that it became unbearable. When the sea learnt of the mask, it was quick to respond. It made known its threat that whosoever used the mask would bring the sea's wrath down on them. For in vengeance, the sea would rise and flood all the lands and drown the living. So, no one's ever used the mask? No, but... So you don't actually know if it works, how it works? Of course I do. The myths tell me. You believe the myths? Only ignorant fools belittle their significance. Besides, it's not the myths that are on trial here. It's the thief. Did for Siri. On the one hand, a theft. On the other, Siri's life. I also care deeply for the girl. I proposed a series of other methods. Yennefer refused to listen. She claimed they would take too long. For as she wants, she needs immediate results. She has always been hot headed. True. At least this time she's got a valid reason for it. Never mind that she might bring. What? What was that? No. Jennifer's used the mask. God damn you, Jennifer. Follow me. We must neutralize the mask. Mutant power. You could have told us what's going to happen. I don't like this about her. I'm sorry, White Wolf, but you have to die. You were attacking me. This is what I don't like her, she doesn't talk that much. Where is she? Where are all these people coming? Talk to Jennifer. Oh, she's right here. What the heck, what are you looking at? Guys, she's right what here. Now, piece of gold. I'm doing 600 damage right now. I don't know why I'm so powerful right now. But it seems like I'm not one shotting them. Unicorns. Damn it, Yen. I saw the foglets. I meant how they get here. The power of the mask summoned them. What now? The mask reveals the past, but only in certain places. Places where past events left a strong magical imprint. Take it. Want me to wear it? Yes. I'll cast a spell that will let me see through your eyes. That's convenient. Gonna read my mind again? You object? Yes. You know I don't like it. Let it go. I just want to see what happened. Besides, you know there are things I'd rather not know about you. Let's go. Already found the first spot. So this is the place that Siri you have in your quest item. So R1. Just like that. I need to loot these guys. Beforehand, foglets, froglet tits. That's pretty disgusting, but we need that to craft some armor and some better weapon. Where is Jennifer? She's right here. 
You cannot attack this side. I not. I don't want to attack her. This is the spot. Put on the mask. Any instructions? Keep it on until you've seen everything, and don't stray far. Telepathy is limited in range. Yeah, I hate this part. I need to follow a line, and it doesn't let me do ah uh, outside of it. Go outside of it. What the freaking frack. I swear this game freaking hate it so much right now. Yennefer, I are you going to do anything? I should stop playing. I, I should stop playing. Ah oh, my days. I should stop playing and just What's that? A portal? Two people emerged from it. The woman was Siri. How can you know? The way she moved, like a witcher. Seems they went that way. Come. Let's find the next spot. This is what I hate about this game. It doesn't let me do anything. It just... Uh, le it just... What the... F Jennifer, can you do something please? I don't know why I'm becoming irritable. I don't know why. On the mask. I would just uh, oh it's just n a normal person right what the heck I was just a normal person uh, br 30 minutes ago what's going on watch out okay that's definitely Siri who is the other guy what was that mm. A magic explosion of some sort. So powerful that even the echo was dangerous. I wager it destroyed the forest. But Siri and her companion weren't harmed. I saw them escape. Let's see where to. Come on, Jennifer, you can run this faster. This is creepy. I don't like it. Nor do I. Anyone here when this happened had a slim chance of surviving. I know what you're thinking, but don't worry. Siri can take care of herself. I know. I know that. So why do we need to find her? If she can take care of herself, why do we need to find her? So Jennifer, I'm doing all the job here. I found the mask, I murdered the mask, I'm killing the monsters. Ready? Use the mask. These guys, what are you doing? Someone chased Siri. See that? Might have wounded her. She escaped through another portal. Know where it led? I guess this the Magic those to those guys that are attacking her are the wild hunt. His portal's got to be nearby. I'll try to find it. Come. Can you please go faster? I want this session of gameplay to be true. And I'm going to stop here recording. I'm becoming irritable. I don't know why. I'm become annoyed. Don the mask. Yeah, these are definitely the wild hunt. One repelled the other with powerful magic, then fled through a port. A mage? Most likely. It's Siri's companion and the one who wounded her. How do you know? I don't. Making an educated guess. They both appeared in the previous visions. Siri's got a powerful ally. Maybe something left of the one who got hit by the spell. It's clearing up. Ermion must be getting a handle on the weather. Which means he'll be free to attack us again. Are you pleased with yourselves? Look at what you brought down on us! If someone's death were to help you find Siri, would you start making human sacrifices as well? Relax. Storm's died down. You've clearly got things under control. For now! But who knows what would be a week or two on? Stop panicking! Here's your mask. It is worthless. It's an unwieldy ashtray at best. I hope you've learned something useful at least. Very. I'm talking to Geralt. You! 
You I'll deal with later. So? Got a feeling we found something interesting. Just need to examine one more thing. Went flying in that direction. Are you our companion now? Uh, I don't like it. Something's pinned under that tree. Can you... I can. Geralt, please move. Really, I need to move. Instead of doing that, you could have moved it forward. Oh, anyways, I'm not the one using magic. Armor's clean. No blood, no sword nicks. Ciri's friend must have... What do you call it? Vaporized him. Exquisite. The armor. Oh, the workmanship's unfamiliar. Can't even tell where it's from. Probably because it belonged to a writer of the Wild Hunt. What? So it's true? The Wild Hunt? I feared as much. First here, then on Hindersfjall. What did they want? They're looking for Siri. But why? It's a long story that involves the Elder Blood, Ciri's abilities. Did she, perchance, inherit her mother's skills? Ciri can do much more than her mother could. But right now, we're much more interested in what the Wild Hunt was doing on Hindersfjall. Well, it happened at least a fortnight after the Cataclysm struck here on Ard Skelly. The raids raided Lofoten at dusk in a blizzard. Itself a strange occurrence for that time of year. The islanders sent the wraiths. They barged into their huts, killed anyone who resisted, then galloped inland, laughing fiendishly. Anyone survive? A dozen or so women and an old man. Next stop, Hindersfjall. I'll meet you on the beach near Lofoten. Wait, can't we go together, right now? But you detest being teleported. Don't exactly like potions either. But I drink them when I have to. <laughs> you also drink them when there's no need at all. Very well. Let's go. Stay close to me. Good luck to you. Inform me once you've learned anything new. Why are we talking so much to this guy? So much info are we talking about? I don't even know him. I guess he's a mage of the this this part of the world. I said this that the Skellig Islands are really had uh, a lot of influence Quite a from but if I remember correctly, the Viking culture. One. But anyways, let's go at on with it. I think I'm going to greet you here, guys. Hopefully to see you next time. Raised Hope you had fun. And um, see you it's next time and have a good night. Some kind. We've come at a bad time. There's no good time to talk about the Wild Hunt.